Let me through, Delphine. If it's marked, if it's marked as own, I'm not sure if it's. Okay, so yeah. we're just gonna sleep here with this orc watching me. Sleep for eight hours. No. Sleep for eleven hours. That'll put us at. Eight o'clock in the morning. Freaking Morrowind is like very strict on the um sleeping in someone else's bed. I'm, I'm not really sure. I think I'm pretty sure in Skyrim. I'm pretty sure if you do sleep in someone else's bed, I don't really think they care. But in Morrowind, it's like a crime, and people get angry at you. And it's a type of thing where if you sleep, if you're in a guild, you have questions, and you sleep in someone, someone else's bed, in the guild that you're in, you can get expelled from that guild, and have to like, try to like make it up to them, which is some bollocks. Be yeah, more when it's really good. Um, my most recent thing that I've been doing is a uh, Blood Moon, the expansion. Um, that basically you go to Salt's time, which is more or less basically just Skyrim, with as like Nord-like as it is. Let's quickly go to Belathor's General Goods. I think Belathor is the uh, Belathor is in White Run, isn't he? Riverwood Trader. See if this guy's got firewood on him. It means so much to us to have the claw back from Thank the you lost. so Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Where the heck am I gonna get firewood at? Seriously. So we've got so we've got a, well, a grand. That's pretty good. If I look at what I have. We've got a deer hide. Dragon bones. Oh man, yeah. And he's got... Mmm, nice. Cleared up our weight a good bunch. I'm sorry, Mr. Space Core, but you're worth quite a bit, so I want to sell you. Brief invisibility. Sell one of them. Right, then I'm going to All right, then. leave you then. 1700 gold now. What could it mean? The return of the Dragonborn? And who among us could possibly hold that honor and such power? Hmm? Because, okay, let's see if over here. Lumber pile. I'm not sure if this will allow me to pick up the firewood. It's really gonna be heavy, man. I'm a lumberjack, I work all day. Here for work? Get an axe and bring me all the wood you can chop. Get an axe? Uh. Have an axe for me? Here in Riverwood, eh? There are worse. At least the damn war hasn't got it. Can I just pick one up? I'm going to save. Nice. So that means that technically. 
if I use my survival skills... Harvest the wood. Harvest three pieces of firewood. That did I just do? Oh, nice. So it actually like spawns like a bit of wood. So we've got, I think now we've got dead wood and we've got firewood. Not sure how long that took. Firewood. I guess we don't have any dead wood. I could have sworn I got some. What time is it? So it took maybe like an, an hour, I guess. I'm not sure how, how long. If I do it again. Use. I'm not sure if we'll be able to take this wood though. I think this is only for um. We can like uh, tell him. Oh nice! So we can get firewood. Oh nice! Let's get about. That's four plus three seven. Let's get. Let's get 15 firewood. Oh. Or, uh... Okay, let's let the animation run again. And then I'll, I'm gonna head south to find the wolf. Hopefully this firewood doesn't wave too much. Craft item. Wood. Improves movement speed by... Huh. So when hatchet, can we use the harvest firewood? What? So we have, hmm. Cleaned pelt. Build campfire. I can't remember what it takes to build a campfire. So I don't actually want to build it. Exit. No, I don't want, I do not want to build campfire. Let's go underwater or something. Cancel placement. Oh, so you can't actually build a campfire near a town. Okay. Makes sense. Let me just quickly go. I'm sure this is probably annoying everyone to no end or whatever. But I just want to like make sure we go into a frost fall. Survivor Guide to Skyrim. I just quickly want to make sure I know how to build like, what I'm going to need for a campfire. If this says. I 
firewood, dead twigs. Bow, walking stick. A tent you can outlast freezing rain and blizzards in the open country. A campfire is of limited usefulness when you remain blah blah. blah. Is that... Is this implying that... Hmm... So do I need to tan a tent? Oh actually, oh, oh yeah, we. I think I bought one, didn't I? A small leather tent, bedroll. Okay then. That might, we might be set for a little bit, hopefully. Exit south. And see if we can find any traces of this wolf. We actually get into some combat, I think I'm gonna really enjoy it again coming from I like said, yeah, like here's like the banner basically saying that we're entering Falkreath Hold. Or that's not Falkreath Hold, it's like a... Uh, I think it's like Winter Hold and White Run are like the only um cities that are uh, actually named after like their holds. But like, everything else is like East March, Huffingar, oh this is a I have a map here. Oh, it is Falkreath Hold. Never mind. <laughs> I'm stupid. Like, coming from Morrowind, when, like, your attacks very rarely hit, like, at, at, in the beginning or whatever, actually, like, having a boat that'll make contact with something will be... DEAD USEFUL! Oh! Made some changes, I think, to like the game's I and I files to like make um, third person kind of very zoomed in for when I'm on a horse, so it'll like actually look like I'm on a first person horse. So we have a rock joint, which I'm pretty sure like makes our attack so uh, like lowers our attack or something like that. Reduce weapon skills. Yep. Let me just go into the controls here. So either that has really messed me up. Um, change that. Okay. Just change those. Much better. 